Yo, what's going on, 67 Letter Squad? Everybody doing a ranked 1v1, and I'm playing Iset because a couple things changed with this set to make her pretty darn good, I think. As a team. Pretty darn good. So, first things first, I'm just going to run out the gate and show you immediately. Let me buy my items real quick, though. Um, no, go Aegis. Uh, her one. Look how fast it is. It is so much faster. So, Smite went through this whole quality of life thing that improved the way that things felt and animations matching up with other things and so on and so forth. And Iset is one of the ones that their quality of life change actually ended up being a buff in terms of DPS and, and damage per second that you're actually outputting. Her one is a lot faster, um, like significantly faster. And on top of that, not only did I want to try Iset's like buff it's a it, technically it's under quality of life change but it is just a buff like it's abysmally obvious to everyone around that is is a buff you when you do damage quicker it means you can kill quicker it means it's a buff um so Isat's buff makes her really good she's kind of dropped into the meta and then on top of holy crap that is so fast and then on top of that um bobbles change which if you don't know, I haven't really talked about it much. But uh, Bobble's change is that you have no downside. There's no negative effect towards having Bobble. Um, instead, instead, it is 100% just a good item to buy. And uh, Aset is one of those people that, you know, she always wanted Bobble. But the reduction to her healing was kind of not worth it because of the fact that... I mean, her ult is one big team heal. And if you're healing one big team heal less big, you're probably sad about it. So uh, she never really, you know, utilized Bobble. But with it not having a negative effect and her dealing more damage out of her one, everything is hunky-dory with her. She is, she's gone straight into the meta. Now her damage is... It does still leave something to be desired. Um, I'll be honest with you. I forgot that red buff was up, by the way. Um, but... Okay. I mean, I don't really care, I think. My auto attack's not going off. Um, I was going Bancroft's too. Yeah, I won this game for free, I think. I don't think Bancroft's Vulcan is better than Chronos Pendant. He said... I don't know. I don't know what the fuck this is. I don't know why he's just chasing me. He's ending. Okay. Um. Anyways. I don't understand what happened there at all. To be honest with you. Uh. But. He sets really good. And I'm ready to play her. I'm really. I'm ready to get in there and see what she can actually pull out. And if, you know, this this burst, this increased damage she's dealing is actually worth it. And by the way, he's maxing his turret, I think, because his turret uh, tank two hits on my two or two hits on my one while I'm maxing it. So I don't I don't know if he actually is maxing it or not, but it sure feels like it. Do -do 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 -do. No, he's definitely maxing his one. Definitely maxing his one. Just waiting. There's not much to do here. Other than just wait around. Oh, nice. I will take those, though. Thank you. I'm still trying to figure out why he just chased me around for a while. Like, I'm not even hating on the play. I just don't get it. Like, he, he chased me to my tower, back all the way around, back to blue buff. I don't know. I guess that doesn't matter, right? His blue buff is up. 
Never mind. You got that pretty quick. Getting very poked because you know life steal. All right, this should be free for me. Yep. Nice. I don't think he has the damage to kill me, so I'm just gonna walk away. Actually, I can kind of greed this. I think I can kind of stay. Eh, almost. Almost. That's all right. All right, so here's what I'm thinking for the build. I'm thinking Kronos Pendant Genji's into Staff of Mirrodin. Which gives you some pen and 40% cooldown. And then bobble. And then after that, no idea. Probably just a divine. I do not do damage to him. He's definitely going to want to hurt me here. Okay. okay. Well, that actually shoots through rock. That's kind of crazy because most abilities don't actually go through rock. That's kind of weird that his does. Because almost every ability doesn't go through rock, right? Like it gets stopped by rock. Unbats things like... Pretty sure. I might be insane. I might be lying to your face. Did I do my buff late or something? Why? Why is his buff up like this? Why did his buff spawn so much faster than mine? I actually have no clue. Maybe I was late to the, the initial blue. Hello. Hello, nice to meet you. Okay. A little rude, man. Didn't your mom ever tell you not to murder your friends? Uh, I guess red buff is spawning soon. That's pretty nice. Ow. Oh, that caught me. It's kind of crazy that caught me, to be honest. Because I, I, I thought my one would still be, uh, would still be casting. But I guess, you know, that's... That's actually a downside of the one being faster is you are CC immune or knock up immune, not technically all CC, but you are knock up immune less often a little more because the damage comes out that much quicker. Good to know. Like old E set never gets knocked up by that meatball because you're knock up immune in your one. All right. Nice thinking. I wonder if he's played against a lot of E-Set or if that was just like a uh, lucky timing. I wouldn't be uh, I wouldn't be surprised if he played against E-Set a lot. And that's why he That's why he knew the timing of it, because like like I said, she's very meta right now. She has been chucked into the meta. That's so mean.
I don't want him clearing my wave. I just want to fight him. But he's kind of not letting me. I mean, why would he let me? But like, can you let me though? I stink. Oh, holy that Aegis. That was a, that was a very close Aegis. I don't know if it would have killed me or not. I wasn't paying close enough attention like I should have, but, uh, I feel like it would have. <laughs> Nice. Nice. Very nice. nice Holy up. shit, Bobble got OP. Or got got uh expensive. So Bobble, like I said, it got his it got its nurse removed, and then also uh because Bobble was being bought in every single game ever, I got its price increased by a lot this patch. So it did get nerfed technically this patch. But I never played with the buff bobble before, so just wanted to check it out. You know what I mean? Dang it! Come back. I'm getting tossed. Nice. Dude, I don't even have bobble yet, and I feel like my cooldowns are crazy. What's the cooldown on my one? Only six seconds. Really? I feel like the cooldown was so much longer. I mean, I know she didn't get buffed. She just got the, the QOL change, but... Damn, it feels like... It feels like the cooldowns of her one got buffed a lot. I mean, obviously I'm insane and they didn't, but... It feels like it. Alright. So he's going Typhons now. Obviously I have to go Divine. But we got the 50% cooldown and we got the increased DPS from the one. And I gotta be honest, normally when I play ESET, the videos are like, it takes like three hours to record a good one. Because I just, I just, I cannot play her. I'm not good with her. However, however, this time, it's pretty easy to record. But she's just that good. Even my clear feels better. Ouch. That was very far range. You think I can... I cannot live that. Ow. I was kind of confident that I'd be able to just walk through there and kill him when my cooldown came up. Nice upgrade. Nope. Nope. That Phoenix hurt. Three Phoenix shots for a thousand damage. My god. I really don't want him to get his blue buff again. But I don't know if I can stop him. <laughs> Hello. There goes turret at least. Oh, he just wants tower. Or turret, I mean. Do we think he will be here? No. I mean, there's no real reason to pick that up, actually. I have 100 MP5, and I have max cooldown. I guess I can just do Bull Demon. Because, like... What's he going to do? I'll secure a set ult? I doubt it. Oh, oh, thank you so much. That was actually really helpful. Because it was going to take me a while to do this without that ult. And I'm not even being... I'm not even, like, being facetious. I'm actually so thankful. Because <laughs> that would have taken me, like, 15 rotations of abilities. <laughs> Hello. I'm I'm spammy McSpammerton, by the way. 
Like I will, I will just pop everything all the time. But you gotta juke, you gotta run, you gotta do everything. I'm just gonna keep pressing buttons. Okay, that was rude. Use my one for knock of immunity there. All right, well, I guess I'll just do like Titan now because I can. How much did that do to Titan? It doesn't actually tell me. I did 1200 to him though. I did a lot of damage to minions, but it doesn't tell me how much I did to Titan. All right. We are looking good, gamers. We are looking good. A little more um, never hurt. I don't really want a last item because I don't really know what I want. So we're just going to buy, we're going to buy red pot and we're going to get out there. Also, Extinct is a viewer of mine, if you're wondering why I'm not responding to him, because I'm going to I'm gonna tell him after the game that I'm going to upload the video and see what he says. Boop, 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 boop. Dude, how, how do you play? How do you play against this? You can't run. I'm doing way too much damage. Like my ult did 1,100. Oh, no, that was my... My one did 1,100. My ult did 435. I don't know, man. Like my cooldown on my one is literally five seconds. Which is insane, dude. Uh, GG video gamer. Um, it's literally five seconds. It's just insane. The bulb. <laughs> The bulb. I need to ask him, what the fuck was that play? Hey, question. First off, this is a recording. Say hello. Or don't. I'm not your mom. You know, I'm not gonna... He doesn't have to say hello. Um, But I want to know... I just want to know... Why'd you chase me around the map? I need that bobble in my life. GG. GG extinct. <laughs> I don't know. Is he not? Maybe he doesn't. Maybe he's not a lobby reader. It's a good habit to get into, especially if you play Conquest, not to read the lobby chat after games. But, you know, is what it is. Hope you guys enjoyed the video anyways. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, y'all, peace.